Hello all, it's Dave Jacobs, and today we are going to play some Adventures of Peshko. I actually just got word that this was updated, and it looks like the third level has been added, so that's what we're going to play. Um, I also know that there's like some changes that are made to like the first and second level, I read over the patch notes, but I don't have time for that today, unfortunately. I only have time to play the new level. So, um, once this loads, we'll dive right into it, see what's up, and it's taken a while. Wonder what's going on. Oh, here it goes. I think. Yeah, okay. Oh god. <laughs> There he is! It's Peshko with the weird texture. went okay. What's his <laughs> name, soldier? You can call me Private Peshko. Okay, Private Peshko. Меня зовут Ivan. Well, I appreciate the help, but I gotta go now. No problem. Я тоже должен идти. У меня есть работа. Спасение таких новичков, как ты. Amazing. Oh my god, I'm in love. <laughs> Dude, the voice acting is so good. <laughs> oh, hey, hey, what? What the hell? Look at that. Are we actually gonna see the Legion system in action? Or is that just like a screenshot? I don't know. Wow. Okay. All I understood was Manyaza Vu. The enemy doesn't seem to be aware that you've bypassed into the city. Yet. Good. That means the plan worked. The plan gives you enough time to get to the National Theater. But be aware that as soon as you engage the enemy, the clock starts ticking. Roger that. I... I hope he doesn't mean that the clock literally starts ticking. I do not like timed levels. All I understood was like, Minyazavu... I, for, I already forgot what his name is, but basically it just means like... My name is Yada, you know, like just whatever it is. The rest, I have no idea. Once you engage, the clock starts ticking. Well, okay, there's already enemies here. I don't really think I can do much about that. By the way, can I come back here? Oh! Oh, I'm the best. I was wondering if you could swim under that, but I guess not. You know, there's not there's not a lot of lo like water in Sirius M4. I don't know why. He walked into the water. Okay, great, amazing work, buddy. Tell you what, you stay there. I thought this door would open. Nah. Okay. Hey, remember, once you fire, the clock starts ticking. Okay. I wonder if he actually means that. Uh, uh, pfft, hello? Where'd you come from? What the fuck was that sound? Okay, I'm actually liking this area so far. I don't know why Kamikaze's are spawning so far away, though. They should be closer. Look at that. They're like 10 yards away from me. Yo, get over here. And since when did I get the minigun? I have so many questions. Did I get the minigun in the last level? I forgot. Oh, I did. Yeah, that's right. I forgot the last mission actually gave you the minigun. Anything underwater? No. Damn, okay. What about over here? Can you cross this, I wonder? Eh, no invisible wall. Okay. Oh, and I got a sneeze. <laughs> oh god. I'm dying. Uh. 
You can't get up there? Really? Okay. Yo, imagine if you jumped onto the bridge and there was like plasma barriers that appeared and like a shit ton of minigun ammo and you basically had to fight like clears or whatever. That'd be kinda cool. I'm just thinking. I don't know how that would actually work for the level progression. Oh, hello, snipers. I did not miss you. Where are you anyways? I see one way over there. Oh, I can't really stay here. Thank you, AK, for being awesome. I hope the AK in Siberian Mayhem is as good as you. That's kind of a boss reload. What the fuck is that? Wait, why did they change reload animation? I like the original better. The original one is like so much simpler. And it worked. Is that... That's a zombie. Why is he there? He doesn't even... I mean, he has a head, but you can't shoot it. Okay, anyways. Uh, there's five secrets in this map. I found a switch. I still don't know what it does. You know what? Before I continue, I'm actually going to walk over here. This looks like an area that is going to contain like a secret ambush or something. The sound effects don't line up with the animation. I don't like it. Also, I don't know if it's just me, but... Let me get closer, actually. This will tell for sure. So here's where I'm aiming. Oh, doesn't have bullet decals. Thanks, Crow Team. No bolt. Okay. I don't like it. I don't like it. Give me back the old animation. The old animation looks so much better. I wonder if this is actually a change that the map author made, or not the map author, uh, like the person that made like the weapon did, because it doesn't look as good in my opinion. Just stick with the original. Original animation was clean, it was simple, it didn't have all this weird stuff going on. Also, I can't jump back to the surface, why not? Yo! I'm stuck. Let me, let me back to the shore. What's wrong with you? Wait, am I stuck on the other side of the invisible wall? What's going on? I, I, I literally can't move right now, except for like forward and. No, actually, I can only move in this direction. Yeah, there's there's a wall here. There's a, what? Okay. Why? Is there is there a point? Can I even escape? Yo, dog, this is stupid. Come on, let me get over there, you fuck. Fantastic, the level's already broken. I don't even know what I did. What? What? Why is the water like this? And now I'm just stuck in place, okay. Well, I guess it's a level restart. <laughs> Incredible. Oh, he was T-posing. Did you see that? He was T-posing. Dude, Peshko's hair is so fucked. Look at that. That went okay. <laughs> you can call me Private Peshko. That reaction. Well, I appreciate the help. Меня зовут Иван. No problem. Я тоже должен идти. У меня есть работа. Спасение таких новичков как ты. Someone translate. I don't know what that means. All I know is he said my name is Ivan. Ivan. Okay, that. That one's stupid. Let's try that again. I got cucked by the invisible wall. 
plan gives you enough time to get to the National Theater. But be aware that as soon as you reach the end, the clock starts ticking. Roger that. I don't know why the clock starts ticking. I'm doing fine right now. You know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna rush us. I already did this part. Yeah, take care of the bombers first, and then we take care of those guys, and then I guess we kill you things. By the way, don't you have skill points? Or were the skill points secret? I forgot. I forgot if the skill points were actually secret or if they were in the level. By the way, I have to press that switch. Hopefully the water doesn't do what it did to me last time. That was really weird, by the way. Like, I jump into the water, there's an invisible wall, and it basically traps me in the center of the water. I don't get it. Serious M4, why are you so fucking weird? Also, you can't jump on top of this, really? Like, like imagine this being like a Serious M2 secret where you can like jump on top of there and there's like a secret cannon. That'd be kind of cool. You only get like three cannonballs for it, so you can't do anything with it really, but you just have it. I'm kind of thinking of like that bunker secret like in the beginning of Cronor or whatever. In Serious M2, like, where you jump up on top of the bunker and, like, grab a cannon. It's pretty cool. Also, no, there's literally nothing over here. Why? There's so much potential. There's so much space. Do something with it. Also, this. Like, either wall it off or make it into something. I don't like the fact that you can just, like, get over there. Kind of. Or it gives you the impression that you can get over there. Always try to design your maps by making it so that, like areas that you're not supposed to go. Make it super clear that you're not supposed to go there. That, that reload, I, I don't like how it just snaps up so fast. And the sounds don't sync up, it's so odd looking. Yeah, no one can do that. What is that? <laughs> it's so fucked. <laughs> that is like the weirdest, most bizarre reload I think I've ever seen. Yeah, it's just like the gun immediately just like, ooh, flips up and just like starts doing whatever. I saw how guns work. They have weight to them. The original animation actually did it perfectly, you know, like it was just like simple, rock the magazine out, load another one in, rock it into place, and there you go, that was it. Like the sounds don't even match, like it's just like, yeah, like he slaps it like a second time and there's like no sound effect for it, it's like really quick and awkward looking, I don't like it. No offense to whoever made it, but stick with the original, you did a better job on that one. Oh, you can come over here, but there's nothing. Wow. A thing in the Adventures of Peshko that you can actually jump over. Who would have guessed? I wouldn't. Can, you can't even go up here? Okay. Well, um, still haven't found any secrets, by the way. Gotta start finding them. I hope. The spider looks squeak at me. Ow, get out of here. Oh yeah, also if you didn't notice, I actually decided to turn on whatever this thing's called. Yeah, the show hints, only use in melee. I kind of wish that there was like a second option that said like, only use, because I don't like the fact that it tells me to melee enemies. It's kind of dumb, I might turn it back off, but for now I'll keep it on just to see what happens. It's not like I really need to be told to use objects in the environment, but it's nice to have. I still want to know what that switch did. Oh, can you platform on this, sort of? Maybe? No? Ah. Oh wait, you can kind of jump up it. Yo, look at that. Yeah, you can just kind of like bunny hop your way up it. I don't know how I did it before. Oh, is that like the perfect angle? Yeah, there we go. Yo! 
You're telling me it. Okay. Well, that's cool. <laughs> I got. I learned something new. You can do that. <laughs> Still not feeling too good, by the way. Which, as you can imagine, sucks. Where are these snipers anyway? I don't. Oh, that's laggy. Wrong button. Ah, it's so unnatural. That looks like a bad sign. Drones? Yep. You better hurry up. The clock's ticking. Why do you keep saying the clock's ticking? There's nothing. Clock's ticking. The bell tolls for thee. Okay, drones, get out of here. still nothing over here. I don't like the inclusion of the snipers. I think shield guys would have actually worked better because the space is a little too open to deal with them and they blend in really well. The shield guys kind of stick out of the environment a little bit better. You also can't jump over here. Okay. It's kind of hard to find secrets when all the things that you think are secrets don't work. I still don't know what that button did. I want to find out. I'm pretty sure it activated something back there. Or maybe there's like more of them, I don't know. Or I could be wrong to like unlock something like at the very end of the level. First time playing, I don't know. It's not like it really tells you anything, it just kind of activates and it's like, oh, I did something. Can you go up there somehow? That'd be neat. Also, why is the combat music still playing? Who's... Hi. What are, what are you guys doing over here? Hrvatsko Narodno Kaza Ište? Wait, there's blood on it. Oh, Kaza Liste. Croatian National Theater. Oh, cool. So, Hrvatsko, I know, is Croatian. I'm guessing Naradno is, like, national and... Okay. So, I guess it's actually not too dissimilar from English. Like, you have, like, the subject right up there in the front. Like, that's what you're... That's, like, people, national, theater. Okay, cool. Hey, look at that. I learned a little bit of Croatian and I found a rage serum. Okay. Impressive. I actually got something. That opens. That's never a good sign. And I see a gadget in there. That's also really scary. I don't like... Usually if it gives you a gadget, that's a bad sign. Secret gadgets, not really a bad sign. Uh, when it gives you one, though, then that's when you know shit's about to get real. Especially life gadgets. What, is, what are you? Yeah, life, okay. Ah, bitch ass. Wanted to get up there. Eh. Nah, okay. Can't do it. I miss Stevo. Wish he was still with us. That guy was a legend. He just showed up for like two seconds in the last map and then just died. A gruesome death at the hands of a bunch of clear. That sucks. He was a good soldier. What's in here? Absolutely nothing. You can't even open the door. You can climb this though. That's cool. Aha, I'm up here. What's cooking? What's the point of that? You, you fall off. There's literally no point to the ladder. 
It's cool that you're able to climb up. Oh, wait, I think I'm an idiot. Let me... Yeah, and then I spin around and... Ha okay, and then I'm up here. And now what? Okay. Maybe it's a platforming secret. Let's try it. I have an idea. So you jump up here, you jump here, you get on top of this. You get on top of this. You run over here. You run here. And... I really hope there's not an invisible wall. There is. Okay. Wasted opportunity right there. That could have been a really cool secret, actually. You just, like, run and jump over this and find a serious bomb or something. I don't know. Something. Anything. Oh, yeah. I don't even have the underbarrel grenade launcher because I started this level fresh. That's definitely something to do, is, like, make us up when you actually get stuff, the level spawns you with it. Oh, come on, this is also a secret. This has to be. You're telling me I can jump up... Ah, give me! This, this is a gimme! This is a gimme, guys! Look at this! That is secret potential written all over it. Jump up here, jump on this, and then, like, over the wall? That is so easy! That is such an easy secret. How did you not... Ah, okay. So that kind of begs the question, like, where are the remaining four? If they're not going to be as creative as that, then where are they? Are they just, like, tucked away in corners somewhere? Is that it? Is that how it goes? I guess nobody knows. What about back here? Okay, no. Isn't that cheesy? It isn't, like, smack dab behind... Although you probably could put, like, a secret life gadget or something, maybe, I don't know. You don't want to pollute the map with too many secrets, but... Come on, like, the... As much as I don't like platforming in the serious game, like, the easy shit like that... Like, it, it's just a missed opportunity, you know? This building is very untextured, how are you? And this is the Croatian National Theater. Pretty. I like it. A little dilapidated. Same better days, but hey, you know, I bet it was really cool back at its peak. I'm surprised that this didn't trigger a fight. It triggered a lag spike, it didn't trigger a fight though. The entrance is blocked. I'm gonna need some explosives. I'm gonna have a helicopter drop them off at your location. I think it's too late for that guy. They're coming. Just survive. Just survive. I also like some idiots like blowing leaves out there. I think it's like my neighbor. Why do you have to like start when I'm in the middle of the morning, asshole? level is anyways. Ow. Oh, that should have been a double kill. God, the thing is loud. I should have shut it off already. Whoever it is. I could just kind of do this all day. Okay. Oh, I can actually use this, the regular shotgun on them. That's cool. You know what would be really helpful? Some skill points. Health also works. I'll take health. You know what, I'll actually supercharge on this as well, just in case. You never know.
That was a two for. I'm gonna use this. Oh my god. He... Okay, I think the Nars are actually the most dangerous. And the Kamikazes, of course. Yeah, Nars for sure. Go away, Nars. Very pesky. As soon as you're getting kind of... Should I say it? Yeah, it's getting serious. These Nars. These Nars really are something. Good thing the pumpkin heads kind of stop spawning, then that's good. That reload. That's so uncomfortable to watch. Okay, at least I can. I don't know what I was going to say, but let's try to... Oh, wait, there's still pumpkin heads. Okay. Re oh, and clears. Okay, no. Bad. Bad clears. Oh, and Biomax. Definitely a big no-no. Away with you. I think the weapon reloaded. Yeah, it did. Okay. Oh god. What is all this? Oh, and there's a helicopter. I need to actually get towards it. Pick up the explosives. Yeah, easier said than done. I need to get over there. Need to like push my way through these enemies. You know, I could just use the Rage Serum as well to get over there. I don't wanna. I heard you. Last second. Where did you drop them? Where did you drop the explosives? Oh really, where'd you put them? You idiot. So many firecrackers. And I'm running low on ammo. I don't have the ammo for this. Please tell me that that's it over there. Maybe I do need to just clear out all the enemies, who knows. Mini gun bullets, thank you. I have no idea where to go. Where did you put them? Where? Where are they? Where did you put them? The explosives, Mason. Where are they? The, there's another stuck behind the wall. Okay, fantastic. So I guess... We did it?
did we actually beat the combat encounter? That was pretty tough. I actually thought I was gonna die there. Pretty scary, actually. That was a scary combat encounter. I'm actually more worried about this Gnar that got stuck behind the wall, though. Can I kill him? I can. Good. Maybe you kill him and then, like, the explosives show up. Yeah, because now there's no more combat music. I saw the helicopter kind of come over here, I think. Did he drop it off over here? I don't know. Where do I go? You know what? I do have an idea. It's kind of a stupid one, but let's see if this does anything. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. That little thing? It doesn't even have it doesn't even have an outline. How was anyone supposed to see that? I was expecting like a bomb or something, you know, like or like a C4 crate. Not this. What the heck? How's anyone supposed to find that? That's stupid. Anyways, I'm turning this back off. I don't, I don't like having these. And also, it doesn't even have an outline. Like what? Enter the. A berg. Hope before more of them show up. Okay. Ah. Uh, what now? Hold on. Where do I put them? What? Why is it such a specific spot? Why not just make the whole door the trigger? Okay, I'm out. Yeah. Nope. Uh... Did it work? I don't know. Guess we'll find out. It worked. Oh, and you're forced to take fall damage. That is... Scary. I don't like fall damage. Imagine, like, if you actually got seriously damaged and you fell down and you actually died. And there's, like, no way to progress because you're, like, on two health or something. Like, you're forced to take fall damage. That sucks. That sucks balls. No one's... Ah, it's terrible. I also don't like this section. This section gives me bad vibes. I don't care for it. In HQ. General, can you hear me? That opens. It's a secret. Oh wait, so maybe pressing that switch actually did open up. You know, like that switch from before? I wonder if that's actually what causes this to open up. That's crazy. Let's see, I'm kind of stuck at square one though, I don't have any... Whatchamacallit? Skill points. Besides this one that I literally just grabbed. I can barely see anything. I doubt this looks good on YouTube, because YouTube is not like dark areas.
Especially not with video compression. It does not like dark environments. It's racist. What you got against dark environments, huh, YouTube? Trying to be all inclusive and shit? I see through you. Also, this is kind of laggy. Oh, vampires. I was wondering when you'd show up again. I actually like vampires. There's another one. He's way over there. Away with you. How did that still hit me? I don't know. Oh, frogs. Perfect. Yeah, I can't even see them, the fuckers. So tiny. Just gonna chill out back here really quick. I, I saw that one. Check the corners. This is very laggy. Oh, you can actually jump up here. It's cool. Be even cooler if I could find some supplies. Plenty of stuff laying around. The box. I picked up the box. Oh, were you supposed to use the box to climb over this? Again, how was anyone supposed to figure that out? Without, like, the notification thing turned on? Also, I'm not sure why the combat music is still going. I killed everything. Hey, two boxes. Okay. Damaged me. Oh, there's frogs. Okay. Hi, where'd you come from? I still can't escape, by the way. I think the boxes are supposed to be stacked on top of each other, not like this. Come on, that's stupid. Is there another one somewhere for me to grab? Anywhere? What? What? Dude, come on, that's stupid. That's a secret, apparently. Okay. How many is that? Three? Okay. Got three. Three whole secrets. Count them. I'm also debating whether or not I should quick save. I don't really want to quick save just because I'm having a good run, but at the same time I know if I die, then that's pretty much it. I'll have to restart this. And I don't have the time for that. Um, it's so fucking dark. I have minigun ammo, let's have this ready. Peshko really just to save anything. 
Dude, one is the jump scare. <laughs> Funny. Probably when you approach these lights. Oh, I'm surprised. Okay. Oh. Okay, so this opens very slowly. Always a great sign. I like it when my doors take. Yeah. I like it when my doors take 10 years to open. <laughs> oh, look, conveniently frisk. <laughs> oh, God. What is this? What is this? What is this cutscene? Is that cutscene? What? <laughs> the mini gun was just like, uh... oh man, that, that's too good. Ah, oh, this this mod will be the death of me. The infamous science team. Is that a Half-Life reference? Okay, that one is a little too quiet. I didn't catch what you said. Also, I'm really scared of this. This whole thing right here. I can't even see what's... Don't tell- oh god, it's platforming over this bridge. Eh, I'm not looking forward to it. Yeah, I'm just gonna run. I don't wanna fall off. Not now. Not like this. Just gonna take it slow. Actually, you know what? I'm just gonna run. Yeah, screw it. I'm willing to bet there's a secret somewhere around here, but it's just too dark to see anything. Maybe? I don't know. What do you do? It does something? I don't know what that is. What's it doing? like electrifying up. Oh, look at that. Cool. Yeah. Check it out. Is that gonna kill me? E. I don't trust it. I guess I did the thing? I don't know, I'm gonna head back. Hopefully the bridge doesn't collapse on me. It's still up. Okay, I'm surprised. This one I'm worried about. Nope, okay. Good. We are good. I should have actually saved the life gadget. Oh well. Could have. Ah. Uh, excuse me. What just killed me? What? No, 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 no. What was that bullshit? What just killed me? What on earth? What? Oh, you're telling me I have to do this all over again? Man, you know what? Screw it. I guess that went okay. What is name? So you can call. Guess that went okay, my ass. Okay, well, here's what I'll do. I'm gonna make this video, um, 
And I guess I'll do like a second video where I take a look at like the first two levels and play through them up to this point again. And probably just see if I can notice anything different. Uh, what do I think about this level? I think dying to nothing sucks. I think the voice lines are way too quiet. I still can't understand what he's saying. Um, I also think there's a lot of missed opportunities for secrets, and I think that the secrets that are in the map are kind of weird. As in, they're just kind of hidden, but not really. Like, they're just kind of stuffed in corners. I don't know what to think. First impressions are mixed. I'll just leave it at that. I think the second level I had, like, a really good time with. This one, eh, it's kind of up and down, I don't know. Really weird. Things that I don't like for sure is the fact that, like, if you don't have, like, the objective markers turned on, then you basically don't know where to go or anything. Even though, like, the areas themselves are pretty straightforward. That should never happen. Like, regardless of if the objective markers are on or off, like, it should always be clear what you're supposed to be doing and, like, where you're supposed to go. It's serious, Sam. It's not an open world game. You don't need objective markers. It's supposed to... Yeah, I'll just follow like that kind of linear experience where it's like, okay, go here, do this. And it's supposed to be clear. This had a lot of odd things where it's like you're going through it and it just wasn't very clear what you're supposed to do. So yeah, that kind of sucks, but I don't know. Um, I did like that fight outside the Croatian National Theater, though. It's pretty freaking cool. It was surprisingly difficult, too, so good work on that. I think that's all i got to say for this. Uh, thanks again for watching. As always, stay serious. Take care.